Hey everybody, Nick here. In this video, I want to talk about how you can set up your uh, your own email on your own domain so you look super legit like Nick at SideHustleNation.com or something similar, Joe at Joe'sBagels.com, whatever it is, um, and have it forward to your Gmail where you'll be able to manage your email and reply. This is the uh, setup that I have. So all of my different email addresses all funnel into one main account, and that's the way I prefer to run things. If you like to keep things separate, probably not the system for you, but let me show you how to get this done if you want to uh, give it a shot. First step, so this is cPanel, I should say. If you have Bluehost, this is in web hosting buzz, but if you have Bluehost, if you have HostGator, if you have any of those, you probably have a cPanel that looks similar to this. So what you wanna do is click on that email button and then create your new email account. And this is the beauty of it, it's your domain. You can create whatever you want. So I'm gonna create uh, an account for the dog and set this up at sidehustlenation.com. Let me create a password for him. Okay, and so we'll create this account for Mochi. Next step that I want to do is hit home, and I don't worry about the quota. If, if he ends up using more than 250 megabytes, I'm going to have to cut him off. Next step I want to set up is the forwarder. And so you see there are several accounts that all forward to nloper at gmail.com. So what I want to do is set up Mochi at sidehustlenation.com to forward to nloper as well and we'll add forwarder so there it is it's all set up next step is to go over to your gmail and this is my own version of inbox zero <laughs> I, have, I, I tend not to delete anything and just use the search function instead um, what you want to do is hit settings and then you'll go to accounts and import and add another email address that you own. So here I'm gonna punch in mochi at side hustle nation com and then you're gonna get to the next step and you're gonna get, the, gonna get this scary SMTP server stuff so when I saw this I really had no idea what it was so I had to go find out what uh, what this is all about because Google or Gmail changed this. What you want to do next is go back to your email accounts find mochi or find whichever one you created and hit configure email client. From here on this page you're gonna have the uh, the, ser the server settings and this is what you want to look for. So I'm gonna copy mochi at sidehustlenation.com. Where'd he go? So that's gonna be my username. The server, let's see if we can find the server. Incoming server is server30 at abstract DNS. And again, yours is gonna probably be something a little bit different. So I'm gonna punch that in for server. And you notice it has port. I've got some options over here for port. And 465 is the only one that matches up. So it says 465 on the outgoing server. So I'm gonna use that one and then punch in the password that I just created. And hopefully I typed it right. Okay, so now it's gonna ask me to punch in my uh, verification code. Now if we go back to our inbox, we should see Gmail team, Gmail confirmation, send email as mochi at sidehustlenation.com. So here's that confirmation code. We'll grab that, punch that in here, and verify. And now you're all set. The next step that I would I would have somebody do, it doesn't necessarily work that well when I send a, a test message from my own account, but if I can find somebody on chat, hey, would you mind sending a quick uh, test message to this email, just to make sure that it comes through and that you're able to uh, to hit reply for it as and send it as mochi. Now you can send in in that Gmail setup, you can set up you know whatever name you want in the in the from field. And actually, you can do that back in your uh, in your settings as well. So here is Mochi, and I, if I hit edit info, I can change the name. Side Hustle Shih Tzu or whatever I want to put in there. All right, guys, that's how to uh, forward your email all through your Gmail. Thanks for watching.